posting for another brush my hair, do my hair, and chat with me video. So my day for today because I love videos that take no effort on my part. Um, and I love apparently talking to myself. So <laughs> for sure, for sure, for sure. Okay, I'm trying to figure out the angle here. I don't know why it's different than last time. I don't know where I had my phone last time, but this is definitely different. Do what you gotta do. Why have a mirror in front of me? Just making for like a weird angle. But um, yeah, let's chat. Today is Tuesday. Um, I'm gonna be like talking through what I'm doing to my hair too. I've been doing this so I just got out of the shower. I like just got out of the shower. Um, I've been doing a like wavy hair, curly hair routine uh, because my hair had been very poofy when I was brushing it. Um, so I've been doing that. However, it's not as wet as most people say it should be. Uh, I don't know why, it's just like not. It's okay. So I have this, I'll show it to you for the next thing, but they're like a quarter size and they're tight. Well, my sleeves, quarter size amount of product. This is already going so badly. Yeah, I don't know why my hair feels so dry. Like, it looks very dry right now to me, but I literally just got out of the shower. Side, but I'm putting some leave-in conditioner in my hair. Um, I'm gonna do that to both sides and then I'm gonna like brush it out and I'll talk while I'm doing that. So this is the product. It's TGIN Thank God It's Natural um, a Miracle Repair Leave-In Conditioner. I got it because I was looking for products that don't support age Um, yeah. So how have I been? Um, <laughs> I don't know literally anything that I've been doing. I just read a book yesterday. Um, okay, so I've mentioned before that I work until like 7.30 and I really need to start prepping meals because usually I don't eat dinner until I get home and I make it. So I'm not eating until like 8, 8.30, 9 even sometimes. Um, and it's just kind of really been messing up my schedule. So. I really need to start meal prepping because today like I ordered food to work and I ate at work and I've got home and I've done so much and it's not even 10 o'clock yet like it's just amazing what I can accomplish when I actually can do things immediately when I get home from work I only have like a normal two day weekend, but it felt really long and I don't know why. Well, I partially, I partially know why, partially, partially know why. Um, because I like spent the night at my parents' house last night and then drove from there to work. Um, so I think that just like made it feel different because I didn't wake up here this morning, but I don't know. I was just hanging out with them. is new in my life. I, yeah, I, I think I mentioned this in the previous video. I've been recording videos. Um, YouTube's just been kind of funky. I finally upload them, so I'll just like back list videos. I don't know to upload. Also, I know I mentioned that product, but I have nothing but praise for it. I've been using it for maybe like a month, a little bit more now. Um, and the first time I used it, I was like, oh, it was kind of weird. But the second time, and like every time since, it's been really, really nice. Um, it makes my hair feel, smell so good, number one. And also like feel really nice. Yeah, but it's a little chit chat before I get my hands dirty again. Look at this. <laughs> um, this is the dyno I made. His name is Arlo. <laughs> Face is a little bit crooked, but he's got a cute little heart on his chest. I gotta learn how to crochet kit for Christmas. So I made that and then this one I already own and I've already shown. This is Juno. Um, <laughs> and they're just sitting looking at each other. I'm trying to make a bumblebee right now, but the wing, I was strong as a wing. I can't take a major break. I haven't worked on it in a week. Uh, but I'll work on it again eventually. I'm just gonna scratch my hair now. 
Um, I've been, I started up doing Duolingo, Duolingo, um, like the last week of December. So I haven't started Duolingo the last week of December. I used to use it when I was still taking college language classes, but I'd never tried using it like without taking another course. Um, so I'd like to see how it works without anything else to go off of, but um, yeah, I can only speak English. I've taken French in high school and I took Swedish only a semester in college, um, and I'm just really bad with languages. I think I'm the hardest with, I think I do the worst with listening, um, and sometimes writing too, like I think I can read really well, well, okay. I think I can read well, that's about it, actually. Let me rephrase, that's about all I can do. Well, no other languages, and I'm learning it. I have a hard time understanding English, even sometimes, um, auditory processing disorders, so. Even with, like, speaking English, it's, it just, it goes not great sometimes. Um, have people repeat themselves a lot even when they're saying something like very basic and um sometimes I have to like think through my thoughts a lot before I speak so I think it like translates really badly when trying to learn another language um but right now I am learning Spanish on Duolingo and I'm learning Arabic on Duolingo so I am through like the first section first unit on both of those um like an entire chapter, essentially. The Arabic one is weird. I was curious as to how it was gonna work because uh, it's obviously like not similar to the English alphabet. Um, and it's interesting because it's like only teaching you parts of the alphabet at a time. So right now I can only like, like I just learned some names of people and places, but I only know like J, K, B, A, I, O, U, Y, um, I think those are B, like the only consonants I know are B, J, K, and D, and so there's not that many things that you can spell with just those. It's interesting because like the entire first unit of the course is just those, um, sounds, I guess. Um, so it's just interesting to learn it that way. I think we're going to transfer to the floor and sit and talk, maybe. Um, oh, maybe not. Oh, maybe not. Oh, no, I can't. Okay, we're just gonna sit here for a second. But um, yeah, I'm learning those right now. Um, I've only been doing it for less than a month, so I'm going to try to stick with it for an entire year. We will see how that goes, but I think it's sad that so many other people in the world have to learn English in order to communicate with a lot of people, but so many people who speak English don't try to learn anything else to communicate. And I don't want to, um, oh, I can't think of the word, but I don't want to like contribute to that if I can help it, so. We are trying. I was trying to pick things that I know like, a lot of people speak. Because um, I do think it would be really cool to re learn like a... What was I looking at? I mean, I do still kind of want to learn Swedish, but I think it would be cool to learn like Greek. And I was like looking at a bunch of other stuff, but I was like, no, no. Like, I gotta be smart about this if I'm going to try to do it. I want to do what would help the most in my life. And um, the like two major languages that other people in my area speak are Spanish and Arabic. So yeah, we are trying to do that. Sorry for like the motion sickness going on here. Um, I just got tired of standing up. But yeah, that's this little chat with me video, a little 10 minute video for y'all. Um, again, I love doing these videos. I just don't have that much going on in my life right now. Um, but yeah, there's snow on the ground, which I'm super happy about. I love the snow, and it's been a very, very warm winter. But hold the camera for a second. It's been a really warm winter, but I love the snow. Let me hold it up against this. So, um, 
yeah, I am very, very glad that there is snow on the ground right now. It's, well, there's snow on the ground. It's like this, like, snow and then rain and then snow and then rain. Though we're supposed to get, like, 8 to 10 inches this weekend. So maybe I'll have some fun days off. I am rooting for possibly having some days off this week.